The TYC is a very exciting collection of world-leading research groups who are active in the theory and simulation of materials, all based in London. Together we're about 90 research groups based across four of the world's leading universities, that's Queen Mary University, University College London, UCL, King's College and Imperial College. So with the theory and simulation of materials, you can make predictions in advance, and this saves you a lot of time and effort. Our simulations are, are still much less expensive than, than building and designing a very sophisticated modern laboratory. BP has been working with the universities involved with the Thomas Young Center for a number of years. Uh, and more recently, we've been working through the TYC to look at uh, um, fundamental science research in molecular computation. But increasingly, we've been working with TYC to build uh, our internal capability. So using uh, the academics and the expertise here at the TYC uh, to help to train our people uh, to provide coaching uh, in software and tools and techniques to do with uh, molecular computation. We work with ionic liquids in association with BASF. We're looking at the fundamental structure of the ionic liquids. This allows the company to make targeted decisions about how they use and how they might change their processes to be more efficient, more environmentally friendly. Our business really is about predictive capability, whether that be in terms of what we desire in a new material or in terms of predictive capability of existing materials in service. The load regimes are so complex and the alloy chemistry and microstructure is so complex that it's not easy to do that by empirical means. We have to have models to rely on in that area. I found the TYC to be very receptive to industrial needs and a key part of that is uh, being prepared to listen in detail to the nature of our problems. I think physically based modelling and the TYC in particular have a really important role to play for Rolls-Royce. The problem with experiments is it's very difficult to be sure that you have covered all the different possibilities. Working with TYC is very useful for seeing how more accurate methods of calculating different properties can be used and adapted so that we can estimate whether their properties are likely to be advantageous. The big benefits for industry of materials modelling are that it's a framework for technological innovation and one without which you're sort of fumbling about in the dark. We live in a very complex world, materials are getting more and more complex and they all have to interact with each other. We have to look at life cycles, we have to look at the intrinsic physics, we have to look at the recyclability of stuff and, and the only way really to get, make that all attractable proposition from a company's point of view is to, is to do modelling. Thomas Young Centre is a, is a group of academics who are all dedicated to have an impact in the world and the only way to do that is via companies and we are absolutely dedicated to working with companies to solve the big problems of the world. If you are a company and you are interested in some materials and understanding more about materials um, and think that simulation can help. What you should really be doing is to get in touch. We will talk to you, identify the best people in London to look after your problem, get you over here to meet them, and then we can think further together uh, and take it on from there.